The date's almost arrived, my friends. Dragon Ball Sparking Zero. That's right. We finally are getting another, as they say, Tenkaichi, uh, as we've all seen. And I have yet to react to a lot of the trailers. I'm wondering what they're actually going to have in the game. If you guys know, let me know in the comments. Um, are you guys hyped for this? You know, we just pretty much want to jump right into it. I'm, I'm excited. Unreal Engine on this? How do you not even, like, come on, bro. This will be my first time actually getting to play with Ultra Instinct at the same time, bro. How can you not be hyped about this? It's like my childhood's come back to, to smack me in the face and wake me up. Monkeys. You know, they got to have a classic storyline in there. The question is, are they going to do the what-if scenarios here? Because that'll be where this game thrives, in my opinion. Fucking Raditz battles, bruh. Budokai 1 gave me Vietnam flashbacks. Okay, so they will. The what-if are actually happening here. He's go Super Saiyan versus Overkill. Trunks and Vegeta working together like it should have been in the first place. Bro, this game got me so hyped. I haven't played Dragon Ball since Raging Blast. I played, I, I, I tried out Xenoverse once with like one of my cousins, but like, you know, it's something I actually owned and was hyped about since, since Raging Blast 1. Bro, PS5. I don't like how they split up the characters, though, the, the classic way. I thought they would have gotten away from that by now. I feel like that's a little bit disappointing because I'm like, I'd rather you say, yo, there's 25 characters in a the game. They all can transform into different possibilities. Then for you to try to BS me and talk about some 95 characters in a game, but it's just everyone's different forms. Now, of course, I could be somewhat wrong by that. And then even this layout right here, uh, debatably, in my opinion, could be a little better. But I see what they were kind of going for the, with the UI, you know, and everything. But, um, yeah, you know, let, let me know how you guys feel about it. You know, you guys want to see me play it on the channel? Because don't forget I do that here. Don't forget to subscribe. Watch me on Twitch and YouTube. It's That Slice Kid on both. And I will be covering a lot of this, honestly. Some, some demos, some gameplay, some pretty much everything. Every game you pretty much like. And uh, let me know how you guys feel about things, you know. And I will see you guys later.